baby Why'd you take me for a fool? Now we were sitting on the sofa You beside me, your mind is so far Can't find your love on my radar What's a miss? Did I miss the boat? See how we go from necking to reaching for throats now We trade the names as ho and asshole We have a cut to we're back to aggro I'm Tom Leifer, um, I play saxophone, I compose and arrange in the band like we all do I'm Theo Buckingham, I play drums and write with these guys as well I'm it's Josh Bach <laughs> Sorry <laughs> I'm Joshua uh, I write the rhymes, I, me and uh, Tom, we compose as well, uh, with Theo, and um, yeah, and uh, Faye isn't here, but there is Faye Tracy, who plays trombone, yeah, um, and we are Binning City, microphone shooking, unbeatable like <laughs> grandma's cooking. <laughs> you say I'm always good with words, now give me a We're an alternative, alternative music band, um, Electro Brass, I think, is a closer uh, representation. That was a recent. I said recent, and recent, and close, and the closest oh, representation yeah. of what we do. Yeah. And we come all come from quite different backgrounds. Um, Josh is a spoken word poet. Been like working around London on the London scene, um, and um, I personally I met Faye while I was studying at the Royal Academy of Music. So that's how I met Faye. And also, uh, Faye and Theo studied together in the past as well at Bridge School. Yeah, yeah. It's, so it's, so it's kind weird. of all come together in a weird kind of roundabout way. Yeah, it's yeah. sort it of works. like a very small world of music because I met Theo uh, at a squat. You know, he was drumming, and, and then I just jumped in, and started rapping over it, no microphone for at least an hour, and then he gave me a microphone, and for some reason I was quieter, uh, and that's how I got to know him. But he knew everyone else. Fuck you, friends, so fuck you many ways. Can't see the game. I wrote baby. Uh, I, I used to um, live next to junkies in Hackney and uh, they used to have like huge arguments you know like really really it, they literally broke up every night you know they, they would argue in their flat and then they come out to the corridor outside my window and you know it was and uh, yeah that that was pretty much it that whole you know hustle and bustle that toss and turn in the relationship you know back, back and forth just the suggestion that you know when you reach that point where it literally is touch and go you can go from um, being all cool and you know holding hands and suddenly feeling it's all right and you know off into the sunset and you can literally you know someone might say something or someone might misinterpret something there's just so much miscommunication and kind of like with a lot of the poetry that I, I, I do I tend to put myself in that situation and just imagine what it was like and the first line, I think it was one of the quickest things I ever wrote to be honest, it was like the first line, we were, out, we were sitting on the sofa, you beside me, your, you know, your mind the sofa, can't find your love on the radar and after that everything just literally poured out. The last line I wrote was the one about Tina and Ike. Uh, it, it stood out from the start, like when, when I first heard Josh do it, we tried it a few times and it just stood out from the start. Yeah, yeah The yeah, lyrics we, and the, the whole vibe of the song. It's evolved over a period of time hasn't it, yes, that yes, song, yes. like to where it is now. It's got a common sound, which I think is really good. It feels like we've kind of finally settled into yeah. ourselves as a band and the way we're writing. I think so, there, yeah. there, there are very few songs, probably only one or two, that we kind of say that every member of the band was not, you know, pivotal in sort of its creation. That did not do something and say, okay, yeah, that it might not be a major, much like huge, but it did make a change. And still, you know, we were working with Mark Pell on the album exclusively. He's going to be producing it, making sure the shapes album coming out this year. <laughs> yeah, and um, again, like we've always said, we, we love working with him. He, he has the kind of mindset that just kind of like uh, literally just goes well with us. He's a very easygoing guy, and uh, you can uh, work really closely with him as well. Yeah, I think when we did the EP, it was uh, at the moment. Um, coming out soon, singles coming out at the moment. Yeah. Um, we work really closely with him, and we've got a relationship with him that I think really works. So we'll be yeah. recording with him. We're kind I of think setting we're... some plans and getting some plans going for an album, like sort of next year. Maybe. Early next year. We're, yeah, we're yeah, aiming yeah. for February. 
we'll see. Well, yeah, we're aiming, uh, for, we're aiming for February, yeah. probably that early time, you know. Uh, we're also looking to do every festival on the planet. Thank you very much. Because, <laughs> uh, you know, we, we still haven't had that. We still haven't had that, that huge, massive fe festival run. You know, we, we are probably the, the very last person of our peers, you know, kind of like the group that we've been we were originally associated with. All of them have all gone and done the festival runs and come back. And, we're dead poor and you know, there, there's not enough mud on our wellies yet. Why'd you take me for a fool? We run, we crawl, we fly, we stall, we brawl and we're back on our old thing. All the donuts, as you know, is in live, you know, to do live gigs as well as, you know, uh, record obviously. And they were like, hey, we're booking you for an event. And that time I didn't know who they were. So I was like, yeah, yeah, whatever. And they were like, is there anything else you do? And they were like, oh, no, nothing, not really much, nothing you'd like. And they were like, yeah, well, send me anything. Just, let's just see what you're doing, because I like your music. So I sent him Baby from Accelerate and Crush at the time. And uh, yeah, he was like, this is sick. Do you want to meet up? And let's just have a chat and see what you're, where, where you guys are on. And then we met and we chatted. And you know, he, you know, what's he called? He kept his car to his chest, he kept my car to his chest. <laughs> and then we, he met, you know, members of the band coming down and yeah he, he he just liked he just liked it they really liked what we're doing and how we're moving and kind of like our enthusiasm with not just the music side but also the music pushing side and yeah voila. And then, well and like we said before like the album hopefully coming out in february that's kind of been like on the back burner and i think that's kind of something we're moving forward on now definitely with audio donuts so that's cool so hopefully our relationship with them is gonna keep going keep going good. yeah yeah Make you stay Make you stay They can't, I'm too wicked. They park in my space, man. I pass you a ticket. Blow up when others brick it. Any show I nick it. I see you drop the beat. Can I kick it like a habit, man? I make a bloody racket. Don't face a crack it. Opportunities I smash it. Grand concepts we hatch well. We're underdogs. Nine of us are providers. Trying to so we wait for that day when our names will be on everybody's lips like saliva. Make a little something out of nothing like my guy, Va. Uh. Make a little something out of nothing like my guy, Va. Uh.